Well, there are only six days to go until Queenslanders head to the polls again, this time for the council elections. Last week, Brisbane's Lord Mayor Graham Quirk launched his campaign and today it was his rival's turn. With a theme song, the party faithful and plenty of hugs to go around, this was a campaign launch with all the trimmings. Ray Smith is a businessman fighting for the city's top job, promising to reduce everyday costs. I'll stop the council cash grab on parking metres and parking fines. The residents of this city simply deserve better. Today's big announcement was a pledge to build 10 new All Abilities playgrounds. This is about creating safe play environment for Brisbane's kids. There was less fanfare at the Greens launch, where voters were encouraged to think twice before giving one party too much power. Nobody knows how the public is going to react to the reality of a state parliament that's almost wall to wall one political party. If they want some balance, uh, we're presenting them with that opportunity. But if none of the main political parties interest you, there are alternatives, like independent candidate Chris Carson, a political newcomer who decided to enter the race less than a month ago. He's focused solely on improving Brisbane's public transport network. The more people that support me, the stronger the message is to whoever might get into power. And how's this for a strong message? This sign was organised by a residence group that clearly wants every member of the Redlands City Council voted out. Ashlyn O'Connor, Nine News.